From the moment a Muslim is born, the Adhan, the call to prayer, is given in your ear. At the end of your life, at your Janazah, there is no Adhan. This signifies a whole life of worship. And Dawah, just like the Azan, is a call to Allah. La ilaha illallah. There is none worthy of worship except the Creator. But Dawah is not just for one day. Dawah is something that every Muslim should do every single day until the sun rises in the West. It's been two years since the ground breaking Olympics Dower Day that we did here in the UK. Hundreds of Muslims came to London and we were calling people to the mercy, to the rahmah, to the love, to the oneness of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. And mashallah, now in conjunction with the World Cup, we've got the global Dower Day. You want to be the mu'min, you want to truly believe, then give the thing that you love to others. So I ask you the question, what do you love the most? Go and give da'wah. It's an order from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. So he sent a final revelation um, and revealed through Angel Jibril to Prophet Muhammad, peace and blessings be upon him, to guide us. And he, like I said, he took this upon himself to preserve this book until the end of time. There's people all over the world doing it from Hong Kong to Australia, from Australia to Canada, from Canada to Brazil. In over 50 countries in six continents, Muslims were calling people back to Allah and calling people back to their goal in life. It's global Dawa day. We have Muslims in over 90 cities all around the world calling people to the mercy of Allah. How amazing is that that all across the world that is amazing du'a, there's amazing du'a, they're going out there and they're giving da'wah. Not only that, they're giving the adhan in all these different places. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Ashhadu I bear witness. Muhammad. Muhammad is his last and final messenger. It's his last and final messenger. Al Alhamdulillah, you're Muslim, brother. Congratulations, man. We hope we're brothers now.